Hey guys, Ray's here, another Sekiro Shadows Die Twice achievement guide for you. We're going to be going for Corrupted Monk for defeating the Corrupted Monk. Now, you will not be able to get to this place, the Fountainhead Palace, until after you've done everything else prior to this. And uh, getting the, the stone, the flower, and once you uh, touch the Kuro, it'll give you the incense to go in back to the tent after you fought the spirit form of the Corrupted Monk. And you go in the tent and you'll be transported to the Fountainhead Palace. Now, once you are here, you have the boss fight almost immediately after this gate. So, a couple of things I'm going to be using as a whirlwind slash, as always, and firecrackers. So, with that, I'm just going to go ahead and come up here to the tree. Go to the next couple of trees. Now, you can get a death blow from above. Wait till he does this little posture thing. Now, you got to jump up in the air or it won't work. After that little posture, make sure you time it right and he'll, you just jump. If you jump straight up in the air, you'll see the death blow. Make sure you hit that. Now, from here, you can hit the second death blow. See him down there. Target him and jump and get him. See, I didn't know if it would work or not. And I tended to try to go to that second tree. And ended up missing my opportunity for another immediate death blow. See right here. Right there. If you miss it, you miss it. You will have only uh, so much time before he's actually his little shadow clones are gone. He or she, I'm not exactly sure if it is a he or she, I don't know, I'm just going to call him he. But, you're basically going to wait until that happens again, or you could try to whittle him down. If you fight him all three stages, it's going to be a long, drawn-out fight. For the first stage, you uh, attack him, your attacks don't really do a whole lot to him at all. Your second stage, it does do some damage to him, but you're going to be whittling his life down, and he's going to be chunking your life down. For that matter, I mean, it's going to be a tough fight if you try to fight all three steps along the way. My best bet is if you definitely end up missing the first one, you might want to just die and start over and at least get that first death blow. You might be able to manage with the, both of these, but he's pretty uh, ferocious and has that range with that thing. So you're going to want to do a lot of blocking. And if you can, I try, try this method out just to jump on the trees and get a couple attacks on him here and there. It doesn't work out the best, so... My advice to you is try to do that and mix it in with a couple blocking, maybe get a couple attacks from the wave. If not, wait for him to do his little spirit uh, thing, ghost, if you want, illusion thing, I don't know what you want to call it, his clones, and just go back up his tree here and you'll just target him. If you target him, jump. Just target him immediately and jump. The death blow should appear and you'll get him. Now the last part is really, really simple guys. All you gotta do is throw firecrackers down and melee him until he is dead. Make sure you have the spring-loaded ones and hold RT to spread them out. It seems to do a little better job right there. You see that one? That one spread them out a little bit better to have a little bit longer of a stun. You don't think you get the time. Just quick throw the regular one down and, and hit him. You should be able to get like three or four good hits on him before he actually starts attacking you. Make sure you're consistent with it. Throw firecrackers, hit him like three or four times. Throw firecrackers, hit him like three or four times. Within no time, you'll either break his posture or you'll have him dead. Making this fight a real cinch. Can being from the coming from the probably one of the hardest fights in the game, make it two of the simplest. All right, guys, that's all there is for this method. Thanks for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe. I'll have more guides for you soon. Get the chance to get to them. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you later.